you can't open it all the way like you could before because I had this chase that was over there in that corner and now it's over here in this corner um, so this is where I put decided to put cha my chase and my furry animals um, this is peep that's peep this is brownie that's plum they're just they hang out on the chase with my extra blanket that I actually wrap up in every night and then underneath that's my heating blanket that I use during the winter time over here I just have my tarot cards and my um, book so that I am practicing that. Uh, here's my black backpack that I bring to work all the time. And then over here, you guys have seen this, it's my mirror that I got from Ikea that was $5 and I painted it because it was turquoise to black. So that's me. Hi! Um, over here is my closet. I've already done a closet tour before. I'll link that below, um, above and below um, if y'all are interested in that. But it hasn't changed very much. I am going to change it around a little bit. So if I do do a lot of changes, I'll do a closet tour again. These are my shoes I'm about to wear today. Because I have on no shoes right now. <laughs> um, so I'm about to wear those at the house. Over here is my nightstand still. I have my Himalayan salt lamp. I got an Apple Watch. So this is where it charges. This is my clock thing. A phone. My um, remote for my fan. A Bath and Body Works candle, and this is gun. This is my um. So this used to be my bullet journal. It stressed me out. I stopped doing bullet journal journaling. Instead, this became my bucket list journal. So hair goals. Um, continue to do yoga, and I just this is my bucket list journal. Um, so and it says a dream written down with a date becomes a goal. A goal broken down into steps becomes a plan. A plan backed by action becomes reality. And I got this off of Pinterest, but it said it was by uh, Journey Strength. Um, so, if you guys want to know more about this, let me know in the comment section below. And I will let you guys... And I will talk to you guys about what I do there. And here is Junkie. I'm not going to show you guys. Um, and then below that is all my books that I own. Um, and I also have my other tarot deck right there. Well, it's in crystals and just a whole bunch of stuff. This is a yoga book. These are a lot of books that I read. This is a Hate You Give. A book my friend gave me, Edgar Allan Poe. Just a whole bunch of books. I still haven't read my Harry Potter book. Don't judge me. I need to read that. But I think I'm gonna wait till fall time. Um, then above it is my lamp, my hanging pendant lamp, which I got from Ross. I think it was for $10. This is new. This is my, um, my new tapestry. It has a skull on it. I think it's so freaking cool. Like, Woo, so cool. I love it so, so much. And yes, I'm obsessed with it. It was $12, guys. So, um, I used to have a tapestry behind me. Um, and I'm about to show you guys that wall in a minute. But I took that one down. And I think I'm going to leave my tapestries on this wall. And I'm just going to swap them out. So, I have two tapestries. This one and another one. This more fall, winter. And this one's more spring, summer. So, I think I'm going to swap those two out. On my bed, I have tons of blankets. Because <laughs> blankets are life. Um... So I have two pillows underneath these two back pillows. Well, not two pillows. One's um, this stuffed animal I have named George. He's holding up that pillow. Over here I have a memory foam pillow. Then I have four bed actual standard pillows. Then these are my decor pillows, which I got this one from Five Below for $5. This case came from 
Hobby Lobby. I think it was like $2. This pillow came from Five Below. It was $2.50. It's this Stay Home. This blue pillow came from Five Below. It was $5. And this pillow came from Burleson. I believe it was like $10. Um, so underneath that, I have a cream blanket, which you can kind of see on this corner here. And I got that from Target during Black Friday. It was $10. This blanket, which is... Um, which is actually black and white, um, like this funky pattern of diamonds. This came from Five Below, it was $5. This blue blanket, which also looks like kind of like the sea or something, which is pretty cool. I like the pattern on it. Came from Five Below, $5. And then this pink soft fuzzy blanket, my mommy bought me for my birthday and I think she paid $13 at Target for it. I think it was on sale. Then here is my faux cheap rug. It's not real. Got it from Five Below. It was five dollars. Oh, here's my fan. As you guys know from like the last couple apartment tours I've done, I can't go to sleep without a fan. So this has been a staple in my life. <laughs> um, over here is my dream sign. It lights up, and then I have my dream catcher. You get it, dream catcher. I think it's cute. So I do that, and it helps with bad dreams. Um, over here is my, so my twinkle lights used to be on the wall behind me. I swapped it. I thought it looked really cute. Since they're LED lights, I thought that it would look really cute if I put it on the window because of my sheer curtains. And I think it just makes it look all twinkly and gorgeous at night. So that's why they moved. And I think it looks pretty awesome. I still have my lamp right here. And then, oh, look at that, that looks beautiful. See, this is another thing I didn't think of. The lights make this picture frame twinkle and glow. Um, which is pretty cool, because it's low by the moon. Um, over here is my, that's actually freaking cute. Look, because the sun has my Himalayan salt lamp, it looks kind of orange. And then low by the moon has twinkly stars on it. That's pretty freaking awesome. I didn't even pay attention to that. But these are the frames that I made. I bought them from Michaels and I just put stickers on white paper and it just says love by the sun. Live by the sun, love by the moon. I thought it was cute, so I put that there. This is my dresser. Um, and my dresser came from Target. I'm pretty sure I paid like $40 for it. Now it says it's like $100, so if y'all want this, then you just gonna have to pay $100 or wait till, I think when back to school comes back into play, they'll drop it down for a little bit. So if you're interested in this, I would say wait until then. These are all the books I'm reading. <laughs> um, I got a ton. Um, some books on camping. Just a ton of books. So I'm going to do a um, what I'm reading um, book thing with you guys. So I will do a video on that. This is my nail polish box slash oil centrals box. So it has all those things in there. I got my charger here. Behind there is some seashells. I went to the beach recently with a friend. And those are some seashells that I brought back. This is my case for my... Um, my camera. This is my Polaroid camera. This is my mirror. And this is the thing I swap out on my camera holder. And I'm holding it right now. Um, so that I can use my phone. And then this is my vegan purse. Which I love so much. And I showed it all in a video. I think when I did my closet tour. Because it's so cute and so big. But it's not too big. Thank goodness. And yeah. I think that that is the tour of my bedroom. I'm going to give you guys an overview really quickly. But this is my bedroom, guys. And I think it came out really, really well. I love the fact that I could finally put blue in my bedroom because I really wanted blue in my bedroom, man. Yeah. All right, guys, so that's the end of this video. If you liked what I did to my bedroom, then can you give me a thumbs up so I know that you also like what I did? And also, if you have any questions, just put that in the comment section below and I will definitely get back to you. I hope you guys really like this video and thanks for hanging out with me and don't forget to subscribe if you aren't subscribed already and I love you guys and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!